Kings coming off a 31 and 41 season. They did get the bubble invite. As that play limited to 13 games a season ago. Barnes on the three, too strong. Curry the board, the fling down the floor in stride. The layup. You know, you want to see that contestant get out. You know, it's up to your teammates to make sure they secure that rebound because you're trying to get such a Sacramento. Aaron Fox will pull. Can't hit from three. We saw that last week as well with Fox as Curry finds Wiggins again. Energy around this group after five straight finals and then the injuries that the Warriors had going into last season, the players they lost. Oubre, new acquisition for the Warriors, acquired after the injury to Thompson. And Oubre connects speed, couldn't finesse at home. Looney flags it down, Golden State controls. Curry with some pace. How about Wiggins on a deep three? This game, Richard, Luke Walton, Steve Kerr. Arizona men left and right, Richard. Uh, yeah, that means it's you know, good men. Steph, four nights ago against these Kings. Curry with his first three of this one. Meanwhile, Aaron Fox has four assists for Sacramento Knights. Early in this first quarter, even though you know the Golden State Warriors are a team that wants to get out in transition, they've gotten behind that Sacramento team. It's on another. It's a 23-17 Warriors lead. Nice backdoor feed, Halliburton, extra pass now, Bielitsa in the goal. be key for the Sacramento team. You have him, you have Rashawn Holmes, you have Marvin Bagley, you have a pretty good... Curry's leaning three, uh-uh. And a hectic back and forth sequence, no buckets in it yet, but now Fox. That, I, I, I think, revitalized him, gave him, that was the first time he had a little bit of a break. And I think the Golden State Warriors and Steph Curry and Draymond Green, the opportunity to play against some of the great collegiate players, NBA All-Star, so he understands the game. So having a veteran like that on your team is going to be huge for championship. Big game Saturday. See Steph Curry starting the second quarter on the bench. Final preseason action for each of these teams. 36-34, Golden State in front. Three minutes into the second quarter. Heel finds Holmes on the move. Couldn't finish. How you can collect more wins. If they can get to the middle of the pack when it comes to rebounding, then that puts them in a position to win five or six more games. No, you definitely don't want to miss that. Watching guys tune up sometimes is it, it, just as fun because you start to see the other players and what are we with him and next to him. We saw Bob Myers, the general manager for the Warriors, the man who acquired Wiggins for D'Angelo Russell last year. Oh, as Holmes throws it down. A 42-40 Sacramento lead, five to shoot. Wiggins, step back three is good. Andrew. Before, right? Who is going to be the guy that can score, that can go get a bucket? And Andrew Wiggins has a great opportunity to be that guy. Barnes drops it. It's going to be key to their success. And there is Barnes coming up with a steal. He must have heard Barnes. Me. Yeah. He must have heard me. Oh. Wiggins dished it out. Shot clock winding and the throws again. Guys hooked too strong. Wanamaker the rebound. Two on one. Wanamaker's three is good. Right, that wears on you. When you go to the finals year after year after year, that season, when it, it comes start time, it comes quickly. You experience that going to back-to-back -back finals. Versus them in the finals. So that's the only three and one that matters. And it's just like, Steve, okay. And so he had a lot of fun with this, but I think he understands this is an individual to work down. Uh, and, and, you know, again, getting Clay back and it was unfortunate the injury uh, to Kevin Durant, but that's one of the great stretch honor. Uh, I know he's excited. Uh, you know, Michigan guy, uh, Saginaw, donated a ton of money back to the athletics program. As you the Elitza, the rebound under two minutes to go in this first half. The elites had it to What to do to try and slow him down if he gets going? So, you know, they've done a good job here in this first half on Seth Curry. Oubre hits another. I was trying to throw you a lot. Come on, Ryan. Well, I, I, I think I eventually connected, but it was more of like a reverse sort of like oops a daisy layup rather than I could have thrown it down with authority. How about that? Oops a daisy layup, huh? You should call games. <laughs> Oubre with a three. Wiggins left it. Two for one opportunity for Golden State. Curry will take. And James. 
On the attack, Toscano Anderson got denied by Holmes. Curry goes behind the back. There's a lot of eyeballs on him because he's stepping up and being put in that position to be another high-level perimeter player, especially with Klay Thompson out. In the final year of a two-year, $30 million deal, Curry weaving to the free throw line and... Now, let's Fox act like this is a... Go ahead. No, go for it, Richard. No, I was going to say, let's act like this is a regular game. This is not how you would want to... Oubre. Eyes up. Finds Curry. He got it. An 11-point Golden State lead. Their largest good pressure there from Oubre. And it's turned over by Sacramento. Center of the lane. The flip won't go. The Top of plays you're going to need from Buddy Hill. Curry. Dips inside behind the back. Toscano Anderson and then Wiggins in the corner couldn't get it. Kings not being a great rebounding team. That's the second putback we've seen here in this second half. Curry the flick ahead. Chris going up strong. And Adjustment to the NBA. You talked about it earlier. These players going from being drafted to playing in a regular season game and basically uh, Whiteside has it taken away. Damian Lee going to peel back to Curry on a points. You know, Coach Walton only has so many timeouts. The Sacramento, Sacramento Kings, they've got to share the ball. Goal of the game for Halliburton. Robinson can't finish. Good job with 22 on the night. Curry has 13 in the quarter. 26 for the game. Well, that one's hot. Whether or not they can knock them down. Curry around the loony screen. You bet. Uh, get into the paint. Draw three. And then dump it off the white side. If he keeps drawing that type of attention, good things are going to happen. Fox waits. Fox into the lane. Nice look to white side who squeezes it in. Sacramento. Fox thought about the three. 0 for 5 from there tonight. Nice delivery. Heald setting up tonight's game. Both still working their way back into shape after... Missing the start of camp. Haskell, he I know weighs. He weighs for threes. You know it weighs for threes. I know, I know Extra what weight for threes versus twos. Mm. Okay. <laughs> I know you're more into the analytics than you like to let on. Here. No, not 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 those. He has 19 points. Shot clock fading. In the corner, Lee got it off. And Poole is a guy who might be able to provide it. Michael Mulder, another guy, perhaps. Oh. Sacramento now as well. As these teams have begun to empty their benches. Guy gets it to that one. Here's Mannion. Man, you're trying to get around James. Guy, like, would his game translate the strength, the quickness, the speed? Those are going to be some of the questions for Nico. The duck in. A lot of people believe that. Yeah, so, you know, you're right, Richard. There's definitely a chance. As Mannion saves it, but right to commence lead on the Kings. Mannion cutting through, kicking out. Pools three is good. It's time to talk about Nico some more. Great job handling the pressure, getting in the paint, drawing two, finding an open shooter. This four. He had 29 points in three quarters. <laughs> yes, he did. If anybody's excited to have Steph Curry back. Some pressure from Sacramento in these final seconds. A kick ball.